Ever since the first human genome was sequenced 15 years ago, we've been promised that genetics would one day revolutionise medicine. Today, British scientists took a big step towards that ambition. Georgia is one of the first children to benefit. Her parents didn't know anything was wrong with their little girl until a few moments after she was born. We had um, about 20 minutes worry-free and then um, the doctor came and drew the curtains round us on the ward and told us that there might be a problem. Georgia is now four years old and has had problems with her eyes, kidneys and brain. Doctors couldn't pinpoint the cause, so they decided to investigate her DNA. When we got the call from um, Great Normal Street to say they'd found a gene, it was the biggest day of my life. Um, apart from having Georgia and, you know, it was up there. It just, it, yeah, it feels like we can move forward. Scientists look for differences between Georgia's DNA and that of her parents. They identified a mutation in just one half of one gene that could be related to Georgia's condition. Genomes hold huge promise for medicine. In future, they'll be scanned to diagnose many illnesses much earlier than it's possible now. That information will lead to new treatments and perhaps even gene therapies to fix the errors in the DNA. Combined with long-term health records from the NHS, the genetic data will become a unique resource. For the thousands of children taking part in this project, their genetic codes won't necessarily provide them with treatment straight away, but they'll be the first biological clues as to what's wrong. For parents, that could be incredibly useful closure. And for scientists and doctors, that's critical information for future research. For patients who can spend years undergoing uncomfortable tests in hospitals, genome sequencing offers a fast-track investigation. For a whole tranche of people, this is going to be a whole order of magnitude more efficient than the diagnostic journeys that we've been able to offer up until now. It's going to be much more quick and much more straightforward. Do you put ketchup on your egg? You might do. Georgia's genetic sequence has helped her parents come to terms with her condition. It also told them that any more children they have are unlikely to share Georgia's fate. Genetic medicine has helped this family. It'll help thousands more in future. Alok Jha, News at 10.